A certain private by the name of Beetle Bailey. Beetle Bailey. Beetle Bailey. Don't look like rain to me, Beetle. Uh, how does it look to you? It'll look like murder when I get through with you if you don't get that old cannon polished. I want it to shine so good I can see my face in it. Yuck, what a horrible thought. Right, Dodge? You bet, Sarge. <laughs> We can let you have it. Make it five. Oh, let him have it for nothing, Cosmo. What's this? A cannon. It's gone. It must be those two idiots, Cosmo and Bailey. Find them and get that cannon. Yes, sir. If at first you don't succeed. You try, try again. Check. Hold everything. Here's a guy who's gonna have some dough. Hey, fella, see this gun? Huh? What's going on here? He's gonna tell us he's got a gun. Going, Beetle. Oh, we, I think we lost them. Watch out! <laughs> Molly, wait till a sod sees his chief. You know, Beetle, old pal, I've been too selfish. By rights, that cannon is all yours. But, 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 but. Not another word. Bye now. If I didn't know better, I'd know. I'd say you was a pointer. It's the sword. Let's get it back to camp. I'll take care of those blue blocks later for ruining a jeep. You now remember, Sergeant, fire the cannon when General Gonzalez extends his arms to greet me. Yes, sir. Here he comes now. Now, Sergeant. <laughs> General, I didn't know you cared. <laughs> yes, yeah, Sergeant, keep firing that cannon. I have decided that this will be a 21-gun salute. Yes, sir. Excuse me, General, but I think I'm being fired at. <laughs>
military hero of the nation. Though he doesn't always follow regulations. At the sound of reveille, he is here for you to see. And we know you'll laugh with Private Beetle Bailey. Beetle Bailey. That's the general, colonel, major, and the captain. The lieutenant and the sergeant and the corporal. They will tell you with a shout. They would gladly live without a certain private by the name of Beetle Bailey. Beetle Bailey. Beetle Bailey. Don't let him get you, smiling box. Don't let him get you. Now about General, long distance. Get quiet, Sergeant, not now. What this? Smiling box always gets his man. Got you now, Fritz. <laughs> Can't you see I'm busy? Busy? Have you been on track? Whatever your name is, this is General Stonewall. <laughs> General Stonewall? Get your feet off that desk, put away that popcorn, and turn off that TV set. Hey! The half wit, it's me here, sir, awaiting your orders, sir. Camp Swampy has been assigned to the crash parachute course. You will handpick three men to train for jumping from an aeroplane at 20,000 feet. I'm sending out an instructor in the morning, and I want this assignment completed in one week. This includes you. I? It includes I? Oh, well, how bad can parachute jumping be anyway, hmm? Dear Sergeant Snorkel, I want to write my will. Man, I want to introduce a couple ripcord who will be your uh, uh, our jump instructor. You have been handpicked for the jump crash, the, the crash jump program. We have one week in which to jump from a plane at twenty thousand feet. <laughs> They're a wee bit... Uh, <laughs> ah, chicken, General? Yeah, yes, that's the word. Now, men, the most important thing to remember when you jump is that you will all yell, Geronimo. Got it? Geronimo. Try it. Uh, Jerry and Mo. Sammy and Mo. Mary and Mo. Geronimo. Geronimo! Good. Oh. Now you boys are ready to start jumping. By the numbers, jump! Geronimo! 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 You're first, Sergeant. Okay, jump. I'm afraid of heights and, and blank, Jen. I said jump. No, I'll go first, Geronimo. Yeah, yeah, I mean, Geronimo! Very good, General. Good, good all. This jump is for real. The legitimate goods. We're 20,000 feet in the air. Yeah, all right. Now jump. Geronimo! Oh, <laughs> 
Attention, Bob Wire, stop us. No! Attention, barbed wire, and a minefield stop us? No! That's enough, hero. Look! Red buttons on your coat! 
Oh, Charge, we're having a dance. Yeah, exclusive. <laughs> Twist it, twist it, but do not knot it. Crazy man, crazy! some respect. Everybody up on the roof. All right, then. Follow me. Geronimo! Oof! Oof! I think I missed him. It's no use, Cosmo. We're only making him bigger. And lighter. I feel like a blown-up balloon. If this keeps up, he'll soon be airborne. Hey, the edge. Hey, Zero, drag that packing case over here. Uh, I don't see any. Uh, 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 uh. Beetle. You're a genius. Yeah, I... Yeah, I... <laughs> Good pies always make me smart. <laughs> it couldn't be. So how come it is? A flying sergeant? <laughs> Don't worry, Sarge. We're sticking right with you. That's what worries me. Where are we, Cosmo? Must be New York. Take a look at those buildings. Yeah. Ooh, there's the Empire State Building, the one with the paint. 
check, and we're heading right for it. Help! Somebody help! Think we'll clear it? It is my considered opinion that we were not high enough to pass over it. Poor old Dodge. Come on, we'll roll him up and take him back to dear old Camp Swampy. Ow! Somebody! Put a match on me! Ow! <laughs> Quick, Beagle, he's having a nightmare. Busters, the butt! Got down your half of these! It's okay, Sarge. It was just a dream. It's all my fault, Sarge. I should have known you wouldn't be able to sleep without a midnight snack. Here, Sarge, all you want. Oh, no, 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 no! Never again! Oh, no, 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 no! The Sarge must be driving himself too hard. He needs a furlough. Go someplace where there's nothing to do but eat and sleep.